Hello everyone, Game Dog here, and welcome to Let's Play Hinterland by David Lovato. I went to the RPG Maker subreddit a few days ago and asked for games to Let's Play. This is one of the ones that was that was uh, recommended to me. This is apparently a horror game. So let's go ahead and start this. I'm not used to horror games in RPG Maker, but I'm certainly interested to see how one would play. Oh dear. You've fallen, haven't you? You're awake. Interesting. But where are you? It's time for you to get going. Which way? Does it matter? Hmm. Oh, that's a stamina bar. Look at the top right. As I run around, um, that goes down. If I stand still, it goes up super fast. Oh, that's cool. I like that a lot. Too stormy to go that way. Okay. You won't like what you find inside, I can promise you that. But where else are you going to go? What he said. <laughs> I like that. Now let's go ahead and save over my test recording, and uh, let's go in. Really, you're going to pick that door. Oh, what am I saying? It all ends the same. Ah, there we go. We're in the foyer now. I'm going to try and conserve my stamina, because I hear that, um... Hmm. I hear that, um, you're meant to run from monsters. This isn't the game where you fight people. Okay, so apparently you can, uh, you can, um, uh, you can interact with a lot of things here. Second hand is a move. Oh, oh. Oh, is that outside? Oh, no, it's a painting. Oh, the ticking is slowing down. Now the ticking is getting slower. Okay, so we have a puzzle. What are these gas things on the ground? Interesting. The game has uh, has already taught me that uh, you should probably um, you should probably ob examine everything. I feel like I should play this full screen or something, but I can't really see the OBS window if I do that, so. We got a piano. It doesn't open. Um, should I? <laughs> I don't want to save scum, but I, I, I will if it means I can, uh, let's see. I want to redo like a minute of... Oh, where'd the bed go? Oh, interesting. Maggots? Oh, oh, I forgot I had items. Journal 1. There's a comfort you can only find behind your eyelids, that translucent blackness that shuts out your perception of the world. The world is still there, of course, but for a few sweet black, sec uh, blank black seconds, I can't see it. It's like when uh, when we were kids and we would hide underneath our blankets uh, when we heard some uh, something go bump in the night. If there was a boogeyman out there, um, would a blanket stop him from getting us? Of course it wouldn't. Who knew that? Um, who knew that even then? Isn't that strange? We figured out a blanket could stop the boogeyman. Long before we figured out that um, there was no such thing. That's locked. Stuff all over the painting. Hmm. Oh, what's that? Huh. You walked through the locked door, though. Interesting. Huh? What was that? Oh. Interesting. 
Wait for my stamina to refill real quick. Someone tells me this game wants me to play it with, like, without talking or something, which kind of goes against Let's Plays, but whatever. A bag of flour? What is that? Dead moths. Uh, do I want to? I guess I will. A key inside. Interesting. Looks like I gotta put a Zelda-style bomb here. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's cool! What does that say? Fire your enemy? Five your enemy? Oh. It's making my head spin. I can only do it for so long. I don't think I explored that whole area, though. Um, let's see. Alright, that appears all to be all I can do. That says either five your enemy or fire your enemy. I guess maybe fire is my only weakness against those guys, or my only strength. We have a key at least, and I think I found a locked door over here, so let's go, um... Let's go see if we can unlock that place. Watch out for monsters, of course. Uh, key broke. That's convenient. Alright, um... Plan oh, perfect. We can put those planks over that hole. I heard this is also the uh, the creator's first game. This is pretty cool so far. It seems you have a really good understanding of like um, of like uh, how to make really cool effects. Like the this, this like darkness effect, and I think there's like a lighting plug in as well, or script as well. It does kind of scream my first game, but it, it's a good my first game. This is pretty cool so far. I feel like this could be used as a tutorial as to what you can do in RPG Maker. Alright, so we need a light in order to get there. Ooh. Don't let it touch you. That thing? Okay. Be a crack in the wall right there. Okay, at least he moves slowly. Now let's, like, rush down here. I gotta try it, though. Oh, I can't pause. I was, I was gonna save and then run into him, but... Oh, that's neat that they don't let you save during that. <laughs> that's cool. You can't even open the menu in the... Ooh, okay, okay, um... Whoa. I know this place. Wait, we're all the way back here again? That doesn't seem right. This time I'll do the puzzles, the puzzles over again. Let's go ahead and save this time. Uh, slot three. There we go. Alright, so these guys are gone. Interesting. I'm assuming I was just meant to, like, run up there. Is the Mona Lisa? Kind of. Mona Bella. Hmm. Oh! Sure. Small key. All right. Plant looks like oh, lively plant and wilting plant. Looks like someone's taking care of this place. What's this little speck on the ground? Can't examine it for some reason. Well, that's kind of cool how, like, uh, how these, like, all fallen in the last three aren't, and they just get smaller from there. That's kind of neat. A, uh, bathroom.
Wait, who's that? Oh, a book. Journal 3. I might have missed one. I'll go ahead and read anyway. Most people think of nothing. They're picture, uh, they picture darkness, blackness, but nothing is in black. Nothing is nothing. Who's to say isn't a vast expanse of white? Or it isn't a... I think I found a typo there. Our vision of, um, of uh, nothing has been fed to us by something else. We learned it from somewhere before them. And so on, and so on. Who was the first person who, de who decided nothing was darkness? Sure, without the light, you can't see anything. But blackness isn't nothing. It just means you can't see what's out there. But it's still out there. And maybe you can still see you. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna like. That guy's gonna run after me, isn't he? Okay. Uh, what? It's like a flesh plant or something. I'll just avoid him. The game's probably gonna introduce more uh, quicker monsters after a while. Century of Ice. Oh. Huh. So we're back outside now. Keep coming back. You must really like it here. I don't think I can leave. A lantern. Oh, a gift. Oh, that is so neat. Look at that. I love that lighting effect. I love how it flickers a little bit too. That might be a little bit tough to see on OBS, but... And that's pretty neat. I like that sprite a lot. All right, now I can finally see what's in here. A washing machine? Interesting. Okay, I can already tell we're gonna have to be chased out of here. That one's empty. That one's locked. Might need a key at some point. I don't say if I hold down the shift button, the um, the stamina doesn't go up whatsoever. They're gonna let, uh, let go though, it like jumps up. Let me try something. Huh, interesting. Dust pan. Uh, let's go. Barricade? Is there something on the other side? Hmm. These tiles are a little messed up. Those ones right there, that, that immediately stood out to me. Oh, this room again. Hmm. Oh, this doesn't leave me outside this time. Okay. No one inside. I'm... Wait, wait, is someone in the other armor? <laughs> Defense against deers. What the? Oh. Oh, that reversed my controls. Oh, this painting. There you go. But what? Okay, that's random. Stepping on this blue tile reversed my controls. Oh, now they're back to normal. Alright. Well, if that was a tutorial for, um... If that was a tutorial to teach me about, um... About those sorts of platforms. And actually, that's actually pretty smart if they're gonna throw those in with, like, enemies. I feel like I've been here before. Though that's probably the point of the game. I know I haven't, but like, oh, do I gotta look through all these? Oh, Billy's, uh, Billy's a dummy. If he wanted Jessica to like him, he should, uh, he should be nice, not mean. 
I wish Steven would notice me. You got a box of crayons. Okay. What, that... Hmm. That one doesn't have a chair in front of it for some reason. Teachers hate me. Everyone hates me. I don't hate you, little kid. Billy won't stop picking on me. One of these days, I'm gonna break his stupid face. Report card. Someone's grounded. Bella and me. Oh, well, okay. Journal 2. Oh, there's the second one. That's cool you get them out of order a little bit. Have you seen something uh, move out of the corner of your eye, but when you turn to look, there's nothing there? It's nothing, you tell yourself. You're not. You're not wrong, but I know, um... But I know now. I think I knew it, even then. But now I know. The shadow moves, it runs at hot and hides behind the couch or passes into the space with, uh, where two walls meet. And then it's gone. Only the never truly, um, only it's never truly gone. You just can't see it anymore. That shadow, the darkness, the other absence of light, that's us. That's empty too. A skull. Whoa! Uh, let's go this way. I had to check the trash can. That's Pokemon 101. What is this? This time this usually hurts you. Doesn't smell like wine. Another bathroom. I've been saving a while. All right. I find it really cool how each individual thing seems to have its own, um, have its own, uh, description. Whoa! Oh! Uh, get out of here. Okay. Try not to trigger that again. Don't export all of these. I, I had to try it. <laughs> it's... Maybe I had to do something with that water, because I didn't really, didn't really seem to activate anything else. Does this lead back to, um... Oh, it does! I am going around circles. I thought this room looked way different beforehand, though. I mean, this is really messing with me. Whoa, what are those? Is that an invisible person walking? Um... Let's find out. No. Huh, interesting. We're in the cellar. These bargain bin. Buy something! It's all junk. Magazines, empty shelf. Oh, interesting. I can't even see on the bottom of these for some reason. Oh, Journal 4. Okay. 
Can you imagine um, a universe without life? Uh, picture one exact, um, what exactly is the same as ours. Every galaxy and solar system, the planet and rock and pebble and grain in the sand, exactly the same spot, just nothing alive. Everything's still spinning, still orbiting. All these circle, um, circles running on and on and on until the great collapse, the big reverse, or a simple burnout. Everything's so far apart and so alone until it flickers and dies, like the last ember within the ring of stones, or a candle at the end of its wick. Doesn't it seem odd for all that to exist with nobody around um, to experience it? Doesn't it make more sense if someone put their um, something put things that way just for us? Or maybe that's selfish. Besides, a watch doesn't know um, it exists to tell the time. If nobody's around to wear it, um, those hands still move, and even if nobody creates it in the first place, those seconds still tick by. An empty universe, there uh, would be no point. But that's the thing, there doesn't have to be a point unless someone's around to need it. That's a really interesting way to look at that. Kind of reminds me of the, uh, oh, toy coin. Kind of reminds me of the, um, if a tree falls in the, wo in, in the woods, uh, there's someone around to hear it, does it make a sound kind of dilemma? Like, it obviously does, but it makes you think, like, no one's here to see that sound. I'm, I'm, I'm expecting to have to use this coin to buy something. Let's see. Oh. Um... Do I want to use that? That might consume it. I kind of don't want to use it. Alright, we uh, spent a lot of time in here. Let's go ahead and save. Huh? Oh! Uh, quick. Find something to buy. <laughs> it's... Uh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I don't know why I like that so much. You need to buy something. Like, you need to. That was fun. I like that. That was cool. I don't know why I found it so funny, but I, I like that a lot. I'm an N64. The Endless Maze. Oh, I'm not sure if I want to play that. Unless we save first, that is. Oh, man. Okay, let's um let's try this. Whoa. Find the light, escape the darkness, remember these instructions. They may come in handy someday. And I can't run here whatsoever. They approach. Oh, it's getting darker. Can I go the other way then? They're getting closer. I'm going this way. I'm going towards the light. The light is my friend. Or okay. Abandon hope. I can barely see anything. Alright, just stay near the lanterns. That's all I gotta do. Oh yeah, it is getting lighter. I was joking, huh? Keep going this way then. Oh no no no! Oh nope. Oh, who's that? Um. Can't interact with it, whatever it is. It's getting super dark again. I like this. I meant to win this game though. Oh, a staircase. Ah, this might be the way out. Or. Hmm. Oh, another staircase. Well, it's also possible that, um, that the entire area is looping. Oh no. Not looking good. Might have to at some point. 
as I go completely back, but I'm not sure if that's what the game wants me to do. I can I can't see anything. They found you. Hmm. I might need to win that. I'll probably come back there later. I'm not sure what you would get for that though. Probably like a kitchen. Oh, shot glass. Okay. Hello. No one is available. Hey, what's that? Your call. Please leave a message after the tone. I'm trying to listen. Let's see, like. Hello. No one is available to take your call. Oh, it's just the default. Um. Ooh. Oh boy. I'm going to turn the volume back down. <laughs> if I don't do that, I actually find myself yelling when I play these games. That's never a good thing. Room of Redemption. Hmm. A gray man in there. Okay. Oh. Hmm. Now I got a hammer. What can I do with that? I'll go back in here for now. This is fairly interesting so far. I think I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.